The new off-the-field probe into the NFL includes serious allegations of workplace misconduct that continues to taint the league. The state attorneys general in New York and California issuing new subpoenas today as they investigate claims of harassment, gender pay disparities, and discrimination. The allegations, if true, uh, paint a picture of a very hostile work environment. Also reviewing claims of objectification in the workplace, the AG cited this reporting from the New York Times, who spoke to more than 30 women describing deeply ingrained corporate culture that demoralized some female employees. The NFL is going to have to be able to show, no, we don't discriminate. We, we treat people equally, we treat people equitably, and they better hope that they've got proof to back that up. After a congressional inquiry into allegations of workplace misconduct by an NFL team owner. The NFL has a sexism and a race problem. Tonight, the NFL says these allegations are entirely inconsistent with the NFL's values and practices. The NFL offices are places where employees of all genders, races and backgrounds thrive. We do not tolerate discrimination in any form. No matter how big or large or powerful or popular an entity is, a corporation is, you are not above the law. The NFL says it's committed to a safe, inclusive work environment and will fully cooperate with the investigation. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.